Hey everybody, Techie Prepper here, and just a quick video to talk about the protection from EMP. Uh, this ammo box right here is what I'm currently using to protect some of my electronics from a EMP event that could potentially hurt electronics. So, I don't know if you've heard or not, but tonight we are having a solar event and while it will most likely just give us some pretty colors in the sky there's always the potential for a more catastrophic outcome from this kind of event. Uh, they are saying that this is going to be a small one but why not be prepared, right? Uh, this ammo box according to what I've read and uh, the videos that I've watched online should give me adequate protection against an EMP. Uh, I will put a couple of video links here, but anyway, let's get into the contents of this box. I don't always keep everything in here, but because I do know the event is coming, then I've added a couple of things that I wouldn't normally. So I've got my Kindle, and I do read that normally, uh, pretty much every night, so I don't always keep that in here. The rest of the stuff is stuff that stays within this box. Uh, next we have the light, USB powered light, and that goes along with the Goal Zero system. Uh, works with the Guide 10 battery pack, and I have a second one of these inside there as well. And then we've got my GPS device, though it probably wouldn't be any good for GPS in the case of an EMP, but it would still be a good radio that I can operate on the same frequency as my other radios. Also within here, i uh, got a little iPod Shuffle, because that is a comfort item, music, uh, and I think it would be invaluable in a worst case scenario. Um, Got an antenna for my ham radio. There's the ham radio. Got a regular radio. That's hand crank. Uh, this is a rechargeable flashlight. Very bright. It's LED, so it could be damaged. This is my Goal Zero solar panel. Uh, you can take a look at my review of that. I'll put a link there. And then I just have a number of other lights in here. These are just backup lights that I don't normally use, so why not keep them in a safe place, right? And last but not least, I have a USB stick that has some information on there that I wouldn't want to lose uh, for work and other stuff. I do keep that all encrypted. Uh, I would certainly suggest if you're going to keep valuable information on any kind of media that you keep it encrypted so that just in case it falls into someone else's hands they're not able to use that information be it bank account numbers or whatever it is so anyway just getting ready for tonight's solar event so I figured I'd record a quick video hopefully all we're gonna get is some pretty lights